você. Sex hole. <laughs> Did you write this, Kyle? Kyle, uh. this sex hole I'm required to orate. Is it your work? For tonight's patient. Tonight? It's a custom job. Andrew didn't tell you? Andrew. How could you do this? If I don't feed the fish, they die. So, what's on your mind, Paul Bunyan? So I've just been too busy to shave. Don't worry, it suits you. Andrew, about that kid coming in tonight. Case number 300. Can you believe we're up to 300? I've been thinking about getting us a cake. What do you think? Chocolate? Carrot? Oh, or maybe cup. Andrew! We can't do this to this kid. Well, sure we can. We have him come in, he goes to sleep. We play some words, he goes home. Just like everyone else, every night. This isn't like every night. Why not, Kyle? Because maybe this kid is gay, hmm? Huh? And his father is doing what? Sending him to us to ungayify him? Kyle, how many times have you told me that what we do here has zero validity? Nada. Not. Zilch. How many of these poor suckers have we laughed at together? I won't do it. This is what we do. Me, I smile all day and laugh and shake hands and bring in the people that make us money. Serious money. And you, what? Sit in a room all night watching TV while some person with no common sense takes a nap. Let's face it, you're the world's most expensive and best paid babysitter. What does Curtis think of all this? You haven't even told him, have you? Mr. Uno, Mr. Daniel's holding on line three for you. Thank you, Debbie. Put him through. Hello, Mr. Daniels. Andrew, glad I caught you. Would 7.30 be too late to bring Scott in? Not at all. That would be perfect. Great, great. Fantastic. Bye then. Until tonight. <laughs> 